pachinko-like device is called a quincunx. It uses, uh, it drops beads down and uses these spikes to randomize the way they land and introduce variation simulating the variability in an industrial process. So the students would use this to drop down 10, 20, 30, 40 beads like that, simulating 40 runs of an industrial process. They could press this and drop it down and then see if they could adjust the process to make it better. They might drop the first five beads, discover they're skewed a little bit to that side, so they'll adjust the process in this direction to the right, then drop the next five beads, discover it's... Uh, now skewed to the right where that column is very high, so they would adjust the process to the left and drop the next set of beads, discover it's now skewed that way, so they would adjust to the right, drop the next set of beads, and so they would learn about the adjustments to a process in a, a simulation of a lab we do. And we would ask them to pretend, because this is a simulation, that it is an industrial process that is producing some sort of parts that have to have some sort of specification that they meet, and that they were using some sort of instrument to measure every part, or samples of parts, that were coming out, and see what effect adjustments to the process had. It's anything we do in these quality classes is already a simulation. And we wanted to look to see if we could make the simulations digital, more 21st century, and uh, something that students could experience online.